This is the whole business of the death and resurrection of Jesus. Christ radically transforms, transfigures, changes people by doing what? Forgiving them, giving them new life, and then giving them hope for the future. And when he does this, the individual become truly human, truly themselves. Not religious, but truly themselves. And so this time around is a possibility. And I'm glad that at the age of 10, I found Christ and he's been constantly wanting to change me. And Paul has these wonderful words. Because of the Holy Spirit, we are being changed from glory to glory to become more like Christ. I'm a long way off, but boy, don't I rejoice that that's where I'm heading. <laughs> you know, we've decided to do this pilgrimage for prayer, witness and blessing. And we've, we've prayed now with over 11,000 people since we started the pilgrimage in December. And using simple prayer beads, we've prayed with people in churches, in cafes, in church halls, in schools. A simple way to encourage everybody that we don't have to know how to pray because Jesus is already praying for us. And with the Lord's Prayer, everybody can say that and join in. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, forever. This came to me when I was praying and fasting in the Orkminster for eight days during that bad exchange between Lebanon and Israel. And I was camping there every night. I was praying and I was getting distracted. And I thought I needed something in my hand. And these, I used it then and now they're being made for us. Um, we've been into some lovely schools and that's been a great time of um, fellowship with the children. Um, they ask just the most perfect questions. They can ask very directly what they're thinking and the Archbishop responds beautifully. So instead I ended up doing engineering. I did it for a year and I didn't like it at all. So I left um, engineering and read law instead. And I actually think also law is a beautiful, beautiful sort of uh, subject as well. Um, I always comfort myself that um, I want to be a surgeon I didn't end up being a surgeon. I now love cooking because when you're cooking, you chop up a lot of things. <laughs> Praying in the end is wanting to hear God talk to you. And the most important thing he wants to say to you, you are my friend. This, this, this grounds, um, um, and as you know, because it's a very community sort of ground, some fans and other people get their ashes scattered here. So there's a sense in which the turf itself has memories going back a very long time. And I've been back here last time I came here in 2012, I sat up there. And the facilities were not as good as they are. And I'm just freezing up there. <laughs> but last time I was here, they won. So I don't know what's going to happen on Friday. If they don't, because I won't be here, well, well I'll, tell, I'll tell them what for. <laughs> Bobbing when the red, red, bobbing comes, bob, bob, bobbing when the red, red, bobbing comes, bob, bob, bobbing.